the AET Youth Council film, Low Arousal Version. We have produced this version to meet the needs of people who are on the autism spectrum who may find television overwhelming. For groups of people without these issues, please feel free to watch the Youth Council film, Standard Version. Effective films for people not on the autism spectrum may have music to add emotion and drive the progression of the film, visual effects, zooming in or out and transitions to hold attention, abbreviated subtitles, the option to stop, rewind and replay at will when on a website, content and format that changes frequently, text without accompanying voiceover. We have intentionally avoided all of these techniques in the production of this film. The AET Youth Council was set up to capture and share the views of young people on the autism spectrum and their siblings. They inform the work of the AET. There are 12 members on the council. We lent some of them cameras to record their experiences at school. These are their films. The AET Youth Council How we get to school. Mom drives me to school in the car every day. We dance in the car to songs on the radio and have a laugh. At the moment, my dad drives me. Okay. But soon I'll be taking my bike. I normally go in the car with my um, helper, Kate. Okay. My mum's friend. Okay. And um, I'll go in the car with my dad. I'm glad I don't have to travel in the minibus to get to school because I don't like to be seen as special needs. I get a taxi now. Okay. I go with another student who comes here. Okay. Do you like doing that? Yeah, it's good. Yeah? A bus. And really they have a taxi person who drives and then the, uh, he's called Malcolm, he's my taxi mm -hmm. like, person who drives. Then we have an escort which takes us to the house that we are in mm -hmm. and she's called Penny. What we like most about school. Well, it's quite good and it's also very fun. We do a lot of trips that other schools don't. We've been going swimming this, skiing this term. I like to play the table tennis they've got. Probably the activity room. Okay. They have like ping pong and stuff in there. I like the library because it's nice and peace and quiet. Mm -hmm. I hate noise. Well, the students have designed the school, so it's kind of all good. And I also like it where we don't have any school uniforms. Oh, no yeah. more of their Mitchy clothes. I quite like backfield because it's really, it's like a couple of acres big. I just really like it there. It's a place you can, it's a place that you know when it's safe. And then they've put in like tyres and stuff that you can jump across and they've got an assault course. First we've got to go over these tyres, then yeah. jump onto this like wobbly bolt that goes all like, <laughs> <laughs> Then we've got to get on these like, um, things that we got to stand on. But our favourite subjects are... What are you doing on um, math, science, math and science? Uh, probably music, DT and... PE. ICT. ICT? Yeah. Drama? You really like drama? What are oh, you doing? Oh, and, and um, English with Helen. We well, used to like um, ICT, but now I really like... Um... I'm mean, going into maths a lot. Uh, I'll do it maths. Music is sort of like rock and roll. It's just Helen's quite nice and um, she's te teaching us some quite fun stuff about Romeo and Juliet. We get some help. And somebody helps me. Oh, okay. And your teachers help you, do they? There's this person who just won his one on one with me. The teaching stuff. Really? Yeah. Um, it's sort of, they're quite, they sort of have 
helped me a lot. It was meant to be a single off so that I would um, help with things. Well, as you can probably guess, Tracy. <laughs> Feel free to move the camera on. <laughs> <laughs> And Louis, your support. Support, okay. When I arrive at school, I'm always met by at least one of my amazing team. They take me to registration and support me in lessons. The people in my form make it easier for me because I can work well with them and they always treat me like an equal. We have a time chart. Okay, what does the time chart do? It's not, I mean, it shows us what we're going to do. So it's got all your lessons on it? Yeah. Fantastic. We're here at the moment. Cool. So you know exactly what's so coming next? Yeah. Well, we normally have a pocket pocket schedule that we keep in our pocket so we can know what, what next lesson we have. And I have a thing called an IEP that tells me what I'm doing each day. I can also ask for time out if I'm quite like angry and stuff. Um, and everything's very bold here, so it's really easy to get around. What we do for lunch and break time. But the problem is, you hardly give in, they hardly give you any lunch or you feel hungry after that. We get to choose whether we'd like to go outside or inside, we can just hop back in certainly. I normally, we can, we can, we have normally two crackers or two breadsticks. So we have got a tuck shop, we're allowed two items only, so I normally have the slice of toast and the fruit juice. Yeah, we all eat in the common room, big food and we have microwaves and sort of coffee and, coffee and oh, fantastic. And things. The cafe where we eat lunch is the most terrible place for sensory overload. I have a lot of trouble staying in here for any length of time, but I have always been determined to tough it out and eat with the other pupils. After that, you, you, I normally have like a drink, then, you, then I go to the toilet and then I go off to class again. We have organised tables, but we're allowed to go sit where we want with friends. We have half an, about half an hour for lunch normally, and then we have like another half an hour. We sometimes go outside. And we sometimes stay in and watch a film. We have some great garden spaces at school and I love staying outside in the sunshine with my team when we are relaxed and happy to be free from the classrooms and corridors. Things we like to do after school. Outside, I've got quite a few hobbies. Football's good. We've just, football season has just come back so we're starting doing football training. And I've been doing it for two years. It's Muni Hock tennis and football. Brilliant. I'm with the Muni Hock at the moment. I, I play um, the guitar. The AET would like to thank the members of the AET Youth Council and those who support them for all their hard work. Special thanks to Victoria Erbys. Thanks for watching.